Hello all you young whippersnappers, I'm Papa Cheddar and welcome to ADD Gaming. Today we will be playing a little bit of The Amber Throne. This is our third venture into this world and hopefully it will be pretty eventful. Alright, let's get to it. Uh, now if you remember correctly, we had just opened up a gate to like a forbidden people who hadn't left their area in like forever. And by forever I mean like millions of years, like they hadn't left since before this guy Axis was alive, and Axis is, like, ancient. Like, he's old as dirt. Like, I'm pretty sure Axis was the guy who sent you, uh, into, you know, the coffin. Like, he was the guy who had the star, and he was trying to hold his power for as long as he could. Oh, well, let's talk to Foxman right here. Old Manic. Oh, this is a Manic. Okay, so these are the Manic people. Popple, you've come back. Is that a friend? Popple. Sort of. We're here to see the fourth. She's one of Axis's children. I think he'll recognize her. Old Manic. Oh, Axis? He was the last Amber God. Days have been getting shorter, Popple. The Manic are in a fury. Your welcome may be bitter. Oh, so basically people are mad at Popple. Outsiders? The roaring fish in the sky has roused them. It seems men from the east are landing in good in Goldwood. The Minic will defend their kingdom at any cost, of course. Time's passage is slow after all, it seems. Hear that, Ara? Sounds like we're going uh ah, sounds like we've got competition. Words and mouth, they don't go together. Ara, she called you. You don't quite look like an average human. I was one of the ambassadors to the Manic's fourth king. It was supposed to be the end of an era. But eras never end here. The walls and towers around the forest are sure of that. We're a lost, stubborn lot. Alright, I think that's all that the old Manic guy had to tell us. Let's see what's this. One blistering weed. Cool, I like weeds. Weeds are nice, they're your friends. I mean, not really, I actually hate weeds. Weeds suck. Have you ever done gardening? Like, gardening work is possibly, like, the worst work of all time. I hate gardening. My mom used to make me do it with her. It was terrible, I used to hate it. Uh, they wanted to, like, start this garden in our backyard, and it's it's tiny, you know, it's like a little home-style garden. And, you know, they liked it. I, I didn't see the point. I didn't see the point. I didn't think it was that great. Kind of... Kind of cool, I guess. Hey, you you stop. Kill! Kill human! Oh, God. Angry Manic. Why are we killing the Manic? Alright. Prepare to die, I guess. Manic, you should have came prepared. I mean, I'm not... I'm not your average Joe. I'll kill you. I'll kill you in cold blood. Alright, let's... No, we can't go in there. Uh, let's actually heal up. Like, I'm not doing too good on health. But that can be easily fixed. Let's use a potion. All better. I really like the sound effects in this game. It really reminds me of, like, like Game Boy Advance, Legend of Zelda games, or something like that, you know? The doo -doo -doo -doo. And like, I don't know, just that sort of stuff. Like, it's very old-timey, and I like it a lot. Like, it reminds me of my childhood. I liked my child, my, eh, my childhood for the most part. Like some of it kind of sucked. I feel like some of everybody's kind of sucked. Like middle school was crap. I hated middle school, but like high school was awesome. I loved high school. High school is really cool. It's you know, it's not like it's that far behind me, and I'm like I'm not that old like at all. But it was a pretty cool time. Like I was, I loved soccer. I was a very big soccer player. I started an ultimate frisbee team. It was it was a really fun time. Demon! The pig demon brought humans! Kill! So, I get the strangest feeling that these guys are really rude to Popple. Mimic Berserker? That doesn't sound like fun. Like, not even a little bit fun. Alright, skills. Do I have any skills? Piercing. Removes attack buffs. I think that this guy has attack buffs. Moxie. Yep. Let's use Skybreaker, I think. I mean, I don't think it'll help, but I want to use it. Skills, Heart Strike. 
Alright, there we go. Heart Strike is effective. I really like Popple's gun because, like, people can't block it. And the whole resist thing is probably my least favorite part of this game. You know, like, ooh, I'm gonna kill you. No, you're not. I have resist, and it doesn't even count as a buff. Alright, skill. Let's use that on him. Listen, intimidating people is rude. You can't just walk up to people and scare the Jesus out of them. It's it's frowned upon, especially by me. I really don't like it. And you're probably going to die for it. I'm not going to lie. I don't want to sugarcoat things. You won't live long. And you don't deserve to live long because you're kind of a jerk bag. Like, you're sort of a dirt bag. And you're furry and hairy and nobody really likes you. Nobody enjoys your company. And you smell bad. I'm sorry. That's the way that it is because you're an animal and I'm a human. Stupid Manek, think that you can mess with me? Alright, let's, uh, I think we've already been down here. Let's look over here, see if there's anything cool. Next Manek I see, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna try not to kill it, because I need to heal. I need to heal, like, bad. Let's see if we can catch this butterfly, I want this butterfly. Butterfly, come to me! Maybe the frog? Maybe the frog? I mean, maybe it'll be like the bunny. Maybe it won't be able to catch it and it'll just block her away like an annoying jerk. I mean, that's what the bunny did to us. The bunny kind of made me mad, I'm not going to lie. But that's because I normally kill, like, bunnies in video games. I know that sounds horrible, but it's the truth. I am the bunny slayer because, you know, who knows? What if, what if that one bunny has, like, super valuable loot? Red Manick. So, the Mudkin girls return bringing more disgusting pigs to our golden kingdom. Hmm? Kingdom? You're all delusional. You see any of your kingdom still standing? Redmanick, the mudkin have corrupted you. You must be cleansed and the outsider removed. We're here to see the elder, not your washed up clan. Then you are beyond help. Oh god, um, let's start with a normal attack. Let's hope that skills, hard strike. Oh god, alright, uh, attack. Item, potion. Let's heal ourselves. I mean, Popple needs it. Popple is gonna die. Holy crap. Alright, let's get him, because that's just rude, and he doesn't deserve to live. Skills, heart strike one more time, because he does have those buffs. He does have them attack buffs. I don't like fighting buff people. Buff people scare me. So I'm going to take down those buffs. I'm going to remove them. I'm going to not debuff them, but remove buff them. He has resist. How do you resist a bullet? It's like, oh, that went into my stomach, I guess. I'll decide that it didn't. How's that sound? Pretty good, yeah? No. Okay. I hate him. But Popple's leveling up like a champ. Like, I think almost every fight we've had, Popple's leveled up. I mean, R is leveling up too. The desert is the fate of all who forsake their kingdom. The Mudkin lied to you. The fourth king lied to us all. Don't repeat our mistake. Oh, well, I'm going to go and get that box. So, I mean, if that was your mistake, then yes, I'm definitely going to repeat it. They always act tough until you knock them around a little. Hey, don't take anything they say seriously. The Manik have really lost it. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's not good. <laughs> they still worship the stubborn old kings and resent the last one. Wow. Wow. They are, there's, the Manik are crazy. That's kind of why I left. They were all, they're all crazy. I don't want to hang out with them anymore. Cause they were they they lost it you know they they're batshit crazy oh god I actually want that all right let's go get that loot I want I want loot I'm a loot whore I won't lie I am a loot whore and uh, I'll appreciate any bone that's thrown to me in this game uh, filthy outside I was gonna try to ghost around and grab it but like my keyboard skills I guess they're not that adept Manic druid I feel like you deserve to die because you're gonna buff the crap out of the other guy jump. Jump is an annoying attack. Ooh, defense down. I don't know what I'll ever do. 
besides shoot you in the gut. Wow, he takes a lot of damage very well. Like, he doesn't... He carries his damage well. Like, you know how you'll see a girl and you'll be like, Hey, you know, she's a little chubby, but she, she handles it really well and she looks good with it, you know? Well, he does that with damage. He takes his damage very well. He handles it very well. He carries himself well. He's very well composed. He doesn't look like he's chubby, even though, you know, you know that he kind of is. He doesn't look it, though. You know, very, still a very attractive dog animal thing. All right, let's see what we got. Received one leather robe. Let's actually see if Popple can have any of this. Um, equip Popple manually. Uh, it should be armor. Leather robe. Very cool. Very cool. Uh, nope. Light feather. Increase vision. Oh, that's what the light feather does. Thief's dagger. Increases piercing damage. Forced amulet. Agility by five. And prevents attacks. Attack from lowering. Oh, that's pretty cool. Let's let's actually equip our hero here. Equip uh, manual. I want you to have increased evasion. Um, let's throw the rogue's ring and the hardened ring on her. That way, she is faster, better at taking damage. And we will give you the Thief's Dagger, because I think bullets do piercing damage. And the Forest Amulet. Yeah, prevents her attack from lowering. And she lowers enemies' attack. So I, I think that that's sort of a good little, you know, good little two-for-one right there. Um, let's actually... Items... We're using these potions like wildfire. I'm so glad that we got so many of them because they are a godsend. God loves us. He's telling us through these potions. And I'm sorry. I know I say a lot of religious things. I'm not, like, super Bible thumpy. That isn't my thing, like, even in the slightest. Uh, I have parents. They're not Bible thumpy, but they're very religious. So, like, I kind of grew up around all that stuff. So I'll make, like, God references. Not insultingly or anything like that, but... You know, I am semi-religious. I'm just not like wildly religious. Uh, let's let's hit this lady for a lot of damage. Holy crap! So those bracelets have been helping. That defense increase is well noted. Uh, let's go with skills, heart strike. In fact, like my family is like crazy Italian, and they're like the old-fashioned version of Italian, which is like. You know, everybody goes to church at the same day. You know, like, that's where you see your family. And then afterwards, on those on that same day, you go and see all of your family. But, like, all of my family moved away, so I just got, like, the crap end of the stick where I have to go to church every single day. Not every single day, but, like, every weekend. Which is, you know, the normal time. And it's not that bad. Like, I actually like a lot of the people at my church. They're all really cool people. Like, there's this really old Italian couple, and they are... They are the best, and they're, like, straight off the boat Italian, so they don't, you know, they talk with, like, an accent, and they just love you for, like, no reason, and I love them for it. Like, they'll be like, oh, your family is so beautiful, and I'll be like, yeah, I'm a kid, and sort of, and, like, you know, I'm their kid, I'm not, I don't have a family, you know, I'm not an adult, but I love you for loving me, so thank you, you're, you're amazing, and they're just the sweetest people, I don't know, it's, it's things like that that really, like, make a community worth it. Like, oh, sorry, that was, that's embarrassing, that's embarrassing. Uh, yeah, this game doesn't, like, run off of DirectX, so the way that you record it is by recording your screen and having the game up. I think it might be, like, Flash-based, I can't figure it out quite yet. But that's, like, why you see my, uh, my frame rate counter and all that jazz. Which I'm, I also apologize for. Like, I know that's not exactly professional, but that's that's kind of what I have to deal with. Uh, let's get away from him. I don't like him. He's a rude guy. He always tries to, like, you know, when we were kids, when Pop was telling me about this, but when they were kids, that guy always used to, like, take her food and then, like, stick it in his nose and put it back on her, put it back in her lunchbox. And, you know, she didn't like it, so I don't, I don't really want to talk to him. All right, let's hit this guy. For 391 damage. 391. Very intimidating number. 
Uh, how do you resist a bullet? I still don't get it. Like, how does that work? Um, let's try to use Skybreaker on this guy. I think that he's wearing some sort of, like, mud-coated armor. Yeah, he had mud-coated armor of some sort. Uh, he's dead, though, so that doesn't matter. Holy cow, lady. Like, doing damage much? 527, that's a lot. 484 is a lot. Like, th these are crits, but they're very impressive crits. At least by my books, they're very impressive crits. Hey, I got a trout. I mean, who doesn't like trout? Trout's delicious. Are there trout in here? I guess I'll never know. I mean, that wouldn't make sense. I don't know why there's a little trout pond in the middle of rocks. Oh, God. This guy's so rude. All these guys are just so rude. Um, attack. Let's attack my... Manick? It's Manick. It's Manick. Manick Druid B. I don't like Bs. I like As. As it goes A, B. A comes first. I don't like the A. I don't like the B. I'm not a big fan of the B. So B's gonna die. B is gonna die in fire. Plus, like, my first friend when I was a child, his name was Anthony. So, that A, that A makes a lot of sense to me. Like, I can really vibe with that A. But then, later on, Anthony kind of wound up being a jerk to me. Which is, you know, not, not really a jerk, but we just kind of, like, fell out of touch. So, I'm kind of okay with killing him, too. Like, he can die. I mean, I'll be sort of sad. But, not, not too sad. You know, like, I'll be like, ah, we had a connection at one point. Then, then you stop talking to me. So I can sort of live with it. You know, it's not that bad. What is this rock? Can I pick up this rock? I want to pick up this rock. I can pick up this rock. This game is so pretty. Like, just everything's interactive. Even though this is... I didn't even know I could take that. Like, I've seen, like, 40 of those. I just figured that they were there. Like, I couldn't do anything with them. But no, you can do things with them, like... This game is so freaking interactive, it's great. And, like, I've ranted about this before, but I love the animations. I just love everything about this game. It's just... It just feels good to play. It just feels good to play. And I don't like that guy. He's rude. Um, I told you about the no story. Alright, let's fight him. I don't like Berserkers. I don't like them at all. So that's because I can't deal with their attack buffs. I mean, she has Heart Strike, so I mean, that can sort of deal with it, but I can only hit one guy with that, and that was dang impressive. Um, let's try to end this guy. You went into Berserker stance. Let's get a potion. I can't let Popple die. I love Popple. Popple's my girl. I mean, like, when I think of Popple, I'm like, ah, oh, dang, that girl's so cute. We can just... Look, it's just like a little girl with a gat. Like, I mean, I don't know. In today's society, like, that would be... That'd be pretty intimidating. Like, that wouldn't be cute. I'd be more like, oh, God, that little girl has a gun. Everybody run away. You know, that's that's scary. But, like, in this world, it's sort of like, ah, oh, look at her. She's so cute with her, like, Japanese cloak. I don't know. It just, it just feels very, like end of days Japanese art style at least for Popple I don't know Popple makes me happy she's a cool cat oh, okay so I went around there for no reason let's see what's down here a chest she's one leather belt alright so that's actually good news because that means that we can give Popple more things and if I like doing anything in this game it is manually Oh, no, never mind, that sounds weird. If I like doing anything, I like giving Popple armor, because Popple's a nice kid. She's a good kid. No, no, maybe, maybe not. Maybe not for Popple. Uh, actually, let's see, because there are things that I didn't think... Yeah, leather belt, there we go. Agility and defense. Um, should I already give her a forest amulet? Do I have another forest amulet? Whatever. You can have that. How's that sound? Sound nice, Popple? I thought it sounded nice. Alright, let's see what these red coats down here are all about. Red coats, green helmets. Not exactly the prettiest design, but, you know, ain't bad. Ain't bad. Let's see. Actually, what's in this cave? Let's see what's in this cave. If it's dark in here, I can't promise it I'll stay. That's a spider. I don't like spiders. We're getting out of here. Although, that did look pretty cool. Like, that just looked cool in general. 
let's deal with these guys first, though, because, like I said, I don't like spiders. Uh, I don't like red coats more, though, and in, in a different way. Like, I'm afraid of spiders, at least giant spiders that can eat my face. Hey, you shouldn't be out scurrying around. Ah, I don't know what the hell he said. I didn't pay attention. Fight. What? what? This won't be taken lightly. Yeah, I'm sure it won't be. Your face will be taken easily, though. Red Hound Gunner. Let's see what you got, brother. Let's see what you got. Oh, God. He's got a miniature cannon, huh? Oh, well, there's two of us. I mean, you can shoot one of us repetitively. You're going to die before you get the last kill, though. You aren't going to make it. I'm sorry. You're not going to make it. You're dead now. I warned you that you weren't going to make it, but nobody listens to me. Nobody listens to me, but that's, you know, that's why he's gone. We're too late. The red bullies are already starting trouble. Nobody bullies here but me. See, look at how cute Papa is. Come on, let's stop this while we're, while they're ahead. While they're ahead? Maybe I read something wrong. I know that I do that. I also want to apologize for that. Like, I, I rewatched the video that I posted yesterday, and a lot of the things in it weren't what I read. Like, I'd be like, oh, that's stupid spelling. You know, that doesn't make sense. And then I'd look at it and be like, oh, no, I'm just stupid and can't spell. Uh... Where are they? I don't like these giant ant things, so I'm not going to go near them. Let's go over here. Seems like the best place to go. Kara! Wait, are these Nick? Why are you not another one of the soldiers from the east, are you? Why are you? You're not one of these. Lady. Popple! My girl came back! Ah, oh, that's her mommy! Oof! Hunter. Popple's back! Heavens, we thought we'd lost you for good this time. Always leaving the village off to the outside, or that old swamp, doing who knows what. A bunch of scary red knights just came through, along with a, a man in all white. Thank God they're... Yeah, thank God you're alright. You've had your brother, Nuo, worried sick, and... Aw. Oh, screw hats. We don't like hats here. She, She's... A good girl, really. Uh, eh, I, it's those Minik. They've had a bad influence on her. Ever since she started venturing into the swamp, she's been trying to become an outsider. Can you imagine? Our forest is perfect. Witless outsiders are the ones dragging the world down. Don't mind them. You look well equipped. A knight from far off? The Minik have doubled down on on fighting outsiders. Seems they've hit rough times after those soldiers came through. We've got to find some way to repay you, of course. My accomplice, Nuo, went out to the west to dog, to dog those soldiers. They'll make sure you're in good order. My accomplice, Nuo. Isn't that her brother? So does that mean that guy's not the father? Oh well, who cares. Uh, come to me if there's anything you need to know. Alright, well, let's... Let's go talk around. You know, let's go see what the word on the street is. The Manic don't like fire. It's usually enough to keep them away. Not that an outsider would know anything about weaknesses. Oh, so we wouldn't know anything about anybody's weaknesses. What's with the poncho? You're just jelly. I like ponchos. People from the east look like clowns. No wonder they're stuck out there. No other choice. These guys are really pompous. Like, they're kind of dirtbags. I don't like any of them. Uh, nobody wants outsiders in their village. Wow. All right. Uh, that's that's rude. All right. Uh, I'm actually going to have to cut it off here. But we get to, you know, we get this lovely view of Popple sitting on the rooftop. Anyways, have a lovely day, all you young whippersnappers. This is Papa Cheddar signing off.